Rose. You've just given a summary of the communication between accused number three and accused number five. Just in broad outline, when does this communication commence? And when, up to when does it go? Uh, my Lord, it started 24 October 2014 <coughs> up until 25 January 2015. Okay. It's number three, number five. Three and five. Okay. Look, come on, I get a few dollar was taken. I'm sure she's a good deal. We start to move time. We're going to go to so I've been 24th October 2014, by 25th is January 2015. And we know that according to the indictment, the incident was on 26 October 2014. That's correct, Mother. Yes, the is the 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 now, did you also compile a chart, a chart depicting this communication between accused three and five? I did, my lord. Yes, can you go to your chart? It's the last annex of my lord of exhibit DT5 in bracket C. The last page. Can you explain the chart? Okay, so we will start with the, the section 205 of is of accused 4, uh, 27, 7276681692, Dombisi, Prince, Mkube, Alias Carlos, accused 4. Sorry, is that correct? Uh, you say accused 4. Uh, accused 3, sorry. So we'll start with uh, let's go to the left hand side. Fisikulun uh, Tule, accused 527-7305-9202. Two made two calls off. Um, uh, he received two calls from accused 5. Um, then between accused three and accused five of number two seven seven two three nine nine five seven eight seven and accused three uh, accused five uh, physical tule and accused three um don't be see prince of two seven seven two seven six eight uh, seven six six eight one six nine um, accused five with that number of, uh, 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 phoned accused four 26 times and accused four phoned accused five nine times. This is remember it's accused three. Not uh, accused three, accused three and accused five nine times. That's correct. Uh, in communication between accused uh, 3 and Tom B.C. Prince and Kuwe, uh, 27727668169, and accused 5, accused Kroon Tule, 27766427. Double zero seven accused three uh, Kube found accused five eleven times and accused five Kube found accused three Kube 
54 times. And then 277276618169 Three between and two seven seven one five nine five one two three nine. Fisikuli and Tuli accused five. Accused three contacted uh, accused five and Tuli three times and accused five and Tuli contact accused three and Kube six times. Basically, the common again. Langa <laughs> Can we then go back to the call data itself? It appears on page 3, paragraph 9 of exhibit DD, in bracket 5, in bracket C. If I can then ask you to place each and every all data on, on record <coughs> and if, when we get to the 26 if you can also refer to the towers as, as well. <coughs> Thank you my lord. And we can look at a phone day for the and Page three, my lord, paragraph nine of exhibit DD five C. Okay, fine. So this is the one, yeah. Yes. Okay. Does it the Yes. Where are the towers? Yes. Yes. Well, the tower information was sent to the defense at, the, at, 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 at some point, but we'll get to that at a later stage. Well, they don't have it. They yeah, have but it. It, it, it. It was sent to them. We downloaded the information on the I'm, 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 I'm raising my word uh, with specific regards to the exhibits and that this witness will testify on yes. paragraph 9. As, yes. as is, there are no powers there. Yes. Not on this exhibit, my lord, but on the, on the uh, section 205 that was given to them, there is the tower information. Wait, that will be coming? Yes. Mm. That's what he says, I don't know. Yes. But, but, but we'll, we'll uh, deal with that when we right. uh, For the sake of uh, uh, clear understanding, the witness testified in respect of exhibit DP5C, uh, paragraph 9, as he's taking this course through each segment there. Then yeah. he should also mention what power is referring to or that college. Didn't you agree to do it that way? Because I wasn't with you. The, the, the important date, my lord, is the 26th of October, yeah. 2014. That's where reference will then be So this relates to that date? Yes. The 26th of October, 2014? Yes. But it starts earlier on the 24th. Okay. So we'll start on the 24th and then go to the other dates. But when we get to the 26th, my lord, we'll then, that's where the tower information will then be put on record. So when you... Um, agreeing about the method of leading the yes. evidence. You never spoke about the towers. Well, um, it, 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 it speaks for itself, my lord, that tower information is important for the 26th of October, okay, fine. 2014. <coughs> okay. 
Yeah. Okay, let's see it then. Yes. So the numbers which uh, you want, can you host to put on record, are they colored? Um, yes, they, they are, are colored. colored, yes. Hello? Uh, uh, yes, they, they are colored. They, 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 they okay, fine, yeah, yes. all right, yeah, fine. Just want to understand. Yes. <laughs> I don't know. That is in the domain. I know. That is in the domain. They say you know Aga all about unless, the towers. Unless, my Lord, the state is going to request that. The fact that is going to testify about powers that information be admitted, provision ID was then later on. Huh? Sorry, sorry, I hear you. How do you know that he knows nothing about towers, Colonel Holmes? How do you know that? I'm, I'm, I'm no, I don't know that. But yeah. you, you appear to know that. The court will recall, the reason why I say I know, the court will recall that I think last week Thursday, Friday, when Advocate Mishororo requested Mr. Holmes, I mean Colonel Holmes, to has regard to the information that was from Vodacom. Then Mr. Paul said, I can't comment or I can't, I can't yes, testify yes. on something that I did not compile. On somebody's, on somebody's was, affidavit, that's what he said. Yes, somebody else's affidavit. That right. That information contains powers as well. And then he said, I can't testify on information that I did not compile. Not it that I don't, not that now, I don't then, understand it. He didn't say, I don't understand how to read this information on this section 205 record yes. of the cell phones because I'm not an expert in towers. Is that what are you saying? My daughter stuck on. I couldn't uh, comment on it because it was not my statement. Right. So that's why I couldn't comment. I testified about tower, tower dumpings and uh, the patients. So you have knowledge about that? That's correct, no. You heard it from the horse's mouth. It's very strange, my that, in that instance, Mr. Nisi, what? Objective, Mr. Nisi, no, here is a witness. Fine. Let him proceed, my lord. Yeah. Fine. I was bringing this to the attention of the court. No, no, fine. For the sake of completeness. But he, but, says, but he says he has testified on downloadings, hours. Yeah, he knows. Thank you, my lord. If it comes from him, no problem. Fine, that's what Thank he says. You, Okay, let's hear him say. Please, my lord, you can proceed. Paragraph 9.1. Yeah. Extraction of data 27727668169 from the period 23 October 2014 to 25 January 2015. Okay. Um, the original data is available on if I need to open it. And also the extraction, you will see that um, this is just extraction of the communication. Um, but I've got the original data also available if I need to open it. And um, that is provided to the council already. Lana again. Yeah, sure. We go to Kisha. We go to uh, value number 27726686169 in the October 2014, January 2015. Okay, so it's uh, of Mutabise, Prince Mkube, Alice Carlos, Akis 3. So we will start from the beginning. Um, 27727668169 MTC 24, 10, 20, 2014, 18, 25, 36, duration 174 seconds to 
Second line, uh, uh, well, that I'll just highlight. 2772668169, MOC uh, call or, uh, originating, so he called um, on the 26, 10, 2014, 13, 49, 49 for 47 seconds to 2772399 accused five uh, okay. I propose we do it the following manner. we were finished with 205s which has got the complete picture uh, from where this exhibit ends other party it then continues with other information that we have, the cell ID and the particular tower after the other party. So my suggestion will be, rather than we do it in this format so that we can properly follow it, and I think uh, Lieutenant Hoist will agree. That's the proper way, because the court can see from the original 205, the complete picture of this yes. testimony, rather than read from uh, ex this exhibit. DD5C. I'm not sure if my little colleague can uh, expect that. We get into that, my lord. Uh, we want to refer to both the, the exhibit as well as the original 205s. Um, as I mentioned, just for these three calls that appear on um, paragraph 9 of exhibit DD5C. Yeah. If, if you can. Um, You've already referred to the first well, you one. Tell me, sir, speak, so that we understand that you say you will get to what he said you must do. Yes. That's what he said. Yes, refer to the original two files, which we are going to do now. Can you just open that? Uh, can so, I open it? There is no. Shifts on, on section two files. So yes, the original Malot, that's for all the calls, and then just the parts where there was communication, the extraction of the communication part is the, that's the communication part, the extraction. So you just uh, joined it, so to speak. Yeah, yes, all the, the communication yeah. are joined together. Yes, that's it, yeah. That's it, yes. Yes. Okay. This, this is part from the original. I just uh, take it where the communication was took place. I put that on a separate Sorry. sheet. So that's all the communication with all the, uh, with the Q5 um, from the time 24 October till 25 June. That's Mr. Ramsipi, are you with us? Are you with us, sir? My Lord, I don't know how to explain it. My Lord, with but you're not listening to the yes. witness. That's the problem. Yes. Mr. Uh, Holmes is trying to explain how he has incorporated the Section 205 records yes. and delineated the ones which he says the calls are encapsulated in it. I, I've listened he says it's one document, in other words. I've, I've listened to that. My Lord will call. We've dealt with this evidence before. Hello? Colonel Stein. Colonel Stein had... No, no. Forget about yeah. Stein. Yes, yes, Colonel. But it's 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 same evidence, my lord. I, I just can want to explain it this. I told you guys yes. go out and agree how the evidence. No, we be have there. agreed. There's no, no problem. There's no problem, my lord. What I'm saying is, 
if he explains like this, then we are going to duplicate because he could easily go to the original course where he has summarized all of this information that we have here. Then we can look at the screen as he's explaining against this exhibit DDC. You see, that, that, that's, all I'm that's asking. why I didn't want to get involved. I can't tell the state how to lead its evidence without an agreement from all of you guys. And you assured me that uh, you con congregated, you agreed together with the kennel, and you isolated what you think is the validation of the numbers consent, which either disprove or prove the state's case or whatever. Now, Mr. Baloi says he prefers doing it the way it is depicted on paragraph 9 yes. of exhibit DDD5C, page 3. Is that not what you are saying? Yes, indeed, in my lord. Now, yes. One of the state is dominant, it's maybe there's a method to his madness. Yes. madness. So okay, fine. Thank you. Well, we can refer or open the spreadsheet on the yeah. two files that shows the towers. That's correct, Mother? Yes. Yes. Yes, you can go ahead. Yes. Okay, so I'll, I'll read again from the beginning. So let's, there, let's just make it a little bit bigger. So number Compiled. Can now, Mr. Solola says, no, no, you know what? You must tell them and show them the Section 205 record from where you extrapolated this from. I've got, I've got to read you, my lord, if, if I need to. Uh, there is the original, the, 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 the full 205. See, Section 205. Do you have this, man? anything. This was compiled by the service provider, as I understand. Is that so? That's, that's uh, when I received the, 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 the as, as, uh, as I read this morning, uh, it, this section 205 was obtained as a result of application in terms of criminal procedure act. Right. And then it was put on a CD, that's it. two CDs, uh, one of Excel and one of in a PDF format. Mm. That was sealed by the service provider, mm. I don't know which one, and it was given to me in a sealed uh, evidence bag which I opened and then I extracted that was on the CD the Excel uh, the Excel part and this is the section 205 that was provided by the service provider my lord. Are you with him? I'm with him my lord. Thank you. At least I wanted to know which service provider you said he can Is it Vodacom? Yes. He said he cannot tell my lord. He said he cannot tell. He doesn't know. The he doesn't know the name of wait, the patient. Wait, wait, wait. The numbers of Vodacom, they start with what? 2772. I don't know. How about two? What's difficult with it? Yes, my lord, but the witness never said from the service. No, no, that's common knowledge. That, that's a 27 for listeners is an abbreviation of this service provider, as he says. Do you want to, again, we must adjourn so that you must go over, because it appears there's no under, mutual understanding. My lord, we have.
have given them the affidavit of uh, Ms. Pinky feeling and, and I'm also giving that to, to them again just to show them how it looks like. Uh, in fact, Ms. was in our office, we made uh, copies and she's sitting with the affidavit of uh, Ms. Fathilingem. Madam, I'm not denying that, Madam. I just asked the witness if you can just tell us the name of the agent so that we can zoom into that specific record. That's the only, only thing I asked. Just the name of the agent for that section 205 so that I can zoom into the records and statement, particular statement that he's referring to. That's all my question. Well, we've just given that to <coughs> Advocate Shalono. To, to make it easier for... So uh, they say they've just given it over to you. I think it's better to give it to the witness so that he put it on record in yes. name of the agent. Yes, it must appear on record. It's not her affidavit, my lord. How can she put something that's not... And, and, and we, we've once again indicated that the agent from the service provider will be coming will to come testify. Um, then if it's not her, his, her affidavit, he cannot testify in that state. He cannot testify if it's not his or if it's not kept up with that. My Lord, this is not a statement. This is a section five record. So of a million telephone numbers. Of a million telephone numbers. Oh, not a million. But what my Lord is... I'm just saying several numbers. And this was yeah. given by Brigadier Ganinda on a, on a sealed evidence back. And I'm analyzing section 205. Yes, I'm not yes. analyzing a, yes. a statement, my Lord. Indeed. So this witness says he's not analyzing an affidavit or a statement yes he's analyzing the record of the section 205 numbers which he thinks are pertinent for this case is that yes. so is it good please can we then uh, no but it's obvious we don't understand what's happening no that's the truth we don't understand that's why then this criminal post when he talks about uh, <laughs> extrapolating uh, the relevant numbers from the section 205, Mr. Shololo says he must tell us the name of the person who made the affidavit. Can you see these things don't even yes. come together? Uh, I don't know if Advocate Mr. is still persisting with that request. Uh, after the explanation that we've given, and after the explanation that the witness has given. Maybe start from the scratch. Tell us how you took the disk, opened the seal. Maybe start there. <laughs> What's that, sir? My Lord, like I put in my statement, I received a request from Brigadier Ganinda. Right. I'm going to put a statement from Brigadier Ganinda. Brigadier Ganinda. I received a sealed uh, evidence back from um, uh, Mohamed, um, Sergeant uh, uh, Sergeant BB Moholo. That's the guy. Is from Malaysia. Says of Father Zige. That's Tola. Is that the value? We are now Sergeant BB Moholo. That was sealed in French back. PA five zero one three zero nine four three two. Is that the now the number L P A five. Zero zero one three zero nine four three two, and it was marked first arrest six three six ten twenty fourteen murder. Papa, we will appear now. Your first arrest six three six twenty fourteen murder. Amage Ubulala. And this bag was sealed. I took a photograph of it. I opened then opened it inside. I, opened it. I found two DVDs inside this evidence bag. Let's just come again. It's as if I do again. I touch again. I'm going to pull again. It's from the south. So I think I should pull again. Me na. I'm going to pull again. I'm a DVD. I'm a building. I'm a part of the zone. Can you maybe just explain what were you required to do and just what your expertise are? My, I was required to look for a communication with other accused in this uh, before court. Uh, it's not like that. I'm going to go to get it. Okay, the woman is going to come again. So on my statement, I just extracted the the data from the communication. If I had to put the old two or five, it, it wouldn't be readable on the statement itself. But that's why I've got the section two or five uh, 
on hand that was downloaded or uh, copied to my directly from this uh, DVD on my computer, mm -hmm. and that's why I can just open, if I uh, hyperlink it, so if I open it, it will go directly to the section 205 that was on the DVD. Mm -hmm. to DVD. Are we with the professor in the kennel? Are we with the kennel so far? Are you with the kennel? You got what? No, no, he's giving evidence. Are you with, with the kennel? No. I think if my learned friend can just maybe take the seats, let's, let's proceed with the. Can you just go to the original um, two fives and then just... Uh, <coughs> but everybody has them in his or yes. her computer, is that not so? Yes, in, indeed. So just tell them tell them how the how it's formatted. Maybe we'll make progress. Yes. I know how it's formatted. But you know how it's formatted in your computer, is that not so? That's correct, my lord. Now ask everybody here if that's how that section 205 information is formatted. Uh, this is how the, uh, I think we send it to all, it was given yes, to all yes. the, the, the uh, council <laughs> two weeks ago, last week or two weeks ago already. Yes. Yeah. So I don't know. More than two weeks ago. Yes, my I think just for the sake of progress, Lieutenant Cornell, if you can just go to the original two fives, then read from the original two fives the information that's encap encapsulated in on, on page three, including the towers. I think that that would then cover everything. So let's start with this is the original I'm busy with the original section two of five that I'm busy with now, my lord. Um, so I'll go to Exhibit DD5 F Roman figure one. We all have them, eh? DD5 F Roman figure one. Yes. Those are the section 205 yes. extra. <coughs> yes, you can put so, so I'll just highlight it now the, the first number, uh, 27. Between accused uh, three of cell phone number uh, two seven seven two seven six six one eight six nine and Fischerkulin uh, Tule uh, of two seven two seven seven two three nine nine five seven eight seven. That's just that's uh, the communication. With that number, my we haven't responded to the chorus yet. I don't think that things will be too too far. Yes. We give we give that information to them about on 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 the similar state about two 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 weeks ago. <laughs> two weeks ago. Mr. Yes. Mizi says he doesn't have it. The time when we are chair for about a week and a half. Uh, that's the challenge. It is in the memory stick, Mr. Baloy, uh, my colleague, I think, uh, refers to it as exhibit D25F. How are we supposed to know which information in the memory stick is 
they would execute the 25F. Ask Mr. Ramosi Pedi because he says he has it. How do you know, sir? No, my Lord. No, no, wait. You don't know. Let's ask a person who knows. My Lord, I was just confirming with my learned colleagues if it's the information that's on the disk that we got last week and they confirmed. And I, I do Did confirm. You that information from I do, the disk? It, 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 it's a lot of pages, my Lord, but I, I do have the information relevant to his evidence, my Lord. So, Mr. Melissa, what is your problem? My problem, my Lord, is Mr. Valo, he says that information was given to us as exhibit B, B25F. Now I'm searching among the document that I have here. I don't have some. No, no, he's, he's not saying that. He, he's not saying that. Tell him what you're saying. I'm saying the original copies of the two files were given to the defense in the disk some time ago. And for court purposes, that information will also be put on a USB on a disk and will be marked. Um, mm -hmm. Yes, exhibit DD five F in bracket Roman figure one. No, that's not what he said. I'm, 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 I'm not the. Do you want us to? Do you want us to again? So that no, 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 wait, wait, wait. Otherwise, this is a waste of time. That information is contained in exhibit DD two five F, and the court said, let the defense confirm if it was exhibit DD two five F. Now, even before the court could hear from us whether we confirm whether we've got that document or not, then the witness continued to testify. But I don't have exhibit DG 25F. All that is mentioned here is that that information is still in the, in the, in the, in the memory stick. And in the memory sticks, there's a whole lot of information. So now I'm, I'm, I'm not so sure which one in the whole lot of information constitutes exhibit DG 25F. Thank you. Mr. Lagoy, what were you guys talking about? I have senior advocates, senior attorneys. They meet with Luxon and Fos, Colonel Fos, the expert. And I say form formulate a mode of the Yes. As to how this evidence should be packaged. We adjourn. Then when I asked yesterday. I mean, today, this, has this been done, you say, all of you, yes. yes. But now we all don't know what happened. <laughs> and yet we met. Yes. Can I just suggest again a solution? Yes. Because I'm also in the dark with this uh, exhibit 5 F from figure uh, 4. If the state can just print us those documents, we <coughs> want to show exhibits 5, 4, 5. Numbers from the 205, yes, section 205 record. And, and, and because the other, I mean, there could be a million numbers yes. here. And that's precisely what we, we did. We are not interested in the others. Yes. Telling me that this is Nelson Mandela's number, yes. this is Motrana's number. We're interested in the so called numbers which the so called accused utilize to communicate together or against each other. That's, that's precisely what I did, that's, that's yes. Maybe, uh, I, I'm really not sure what the defense now wants. Maybe if we can just adjourn for a short while just to find out what is it that they want and over and above what we've given them, if perhaps they need guidance as to where to find the information. Uh, perhaps that, that, that might help. 
if they still have a problem, but if they don't have a problem, then the witness can then just continue. So what do you suggest we do? Let's uh, let's adjourn until tomorrow because you, it's a waste of time. I can see people don't understand what's happening. The whole defense doesn't. That's the truth. He has an expert. He, he he testifies as to what he did in terms of the analysis, and we don't understand it. And then we want to adjourn for 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 for, for, for what? one hour. Let's adjourn for the whole afternoon. Madam, and then you come back tomorrow again. So, Madam, not the whole defense. What? Not the whole defense. Okay, some of the defense. Yes, ma'am. Yeah, I've qualified it. You understand, some of the defense don't. Madam, to save time, I'm just worried at some point we're going to run into problems with the availability of Lieutenant yeah. Colonel Hawes. Can we maybe just adjourn for, it's half past 12, maybe just for 15 minutes. <laughs> and and I, I, I'm sure we can even sort out the issues before. You know, uh, before Let's then. Let's until 2 o'clock. Can you assist? Yes, my lord. Okay, 2 o'clock. Okay. Um.